So if you've ever been to the American Museum of Natural History in New York City, it has a set of amazing exhibits. So to bring that to you today, I got 2.5 Pro to code me a simple web app in Google AI Studio to share some photos and learn more. So here's what I have so far, but I want to make it more interactive. And I'm still brainstorming the design, but I've got some ideas. You've seen something like this before, right? Someone comes to you with a brilliant idea scratched on a napkin. As a PM, I'm often this someone. Now, standard two-dimensional web design is one thing, but I wanted to make it 3D. And I learned that jumping into 3D isn't easy. It requires learning about all kinds of new things, setting up a scene, camera, lighting, and more. Luckily for me, 2.5 Pro can help. So here, what I'm gonna do, add the image I just showed you of the sphere, and I'm gonna add in a prompt that asks 2.5 Pro to update my code based on the image. So we'll let 2.5 Pro get to work, and as you can see, it's starting to think, and it's going ahead and creating a plan based on what I asked for. And it'll apply it to my existing code base. Because Gemini is multimodal, it can understand the abstract sphere sketch and code beautiful 3D animations, applying them to my existing app. So this takes about two minutes. So for the purpose of time, we're gonna do this baking show style. And I'm gonna jump to another tab that I ran right before this keynote with the same prompt. And here's what Gemini generates. Whoa. We went from that rough sketch directly to code, updating multiple of my files. And actually you can see it thought for 37 seconds. And you can see the changes it thought through and then the files it updated. We did all of this in AI Studio, so once I finish prototyping, I can simply deploy the code along with my Gemini API key. 